In Excel, we want to create an invoice format in which we have to give the invoice number and its complete details get auto-populated. So, for this, we have to do some simple settings. Here we will type with the equal sign and use the filter tab. Here, in the array, you have to take the data range which you want to auto-populate, such as name of item, quantity, rate and amount. So, for this, you have to go to the data sheet and select the entire range from name of item to amount together. You have to put a comma and see. Here the second argument is given to you, include. So, here you have to select the entire column containing the invoice number. You can see that the entire range is visible to you here at the top. Now you have to equal this range which you have given there at the top with the invoice number. So again you have to go to the invoice sheet and click on this invoice number here and press F4 to lock it. See, the formula has been applied. Just after this, close the bracket and hit enter. Now you have to apply a formula here to extract the customer's name and date, equal to VLOKUP. To make this formula easier, we will press Ctrl A, which will open the function argument. See here, first of all you are given the lookup value in it. So in the lookup value, the cell with the invoice number has to be selected. After this, we have to come down to the table array. So in the table array, by going from the data, you have to select the entire table this time. After this, see, the column index number is given at the third number. So here you are given the column index number 1, here you are given the column index number 1 for invoice, 2 for date and 3 for customer. So here you have to type 3. In the range lookup, you can also leave it blank or type 0 and after this click OK from here. In the same way, you have to apply the formula on the date as well. And that's it, your invoice format is ready. Now if you change the invoice number from here, then the customer's details will also change on the basis of the invoice. So friends, if you like the video, then like and share it.